Alright, this is Ron Goodall from FightHype.com. I'm here with Benavidez Sr. How's it going? Well, I'm here, man. Super excited to be here in Omaha again. You know, I want to thank all the people here from Omaha, man. Uh, everybody's super friendly, you know. Uh, they, they, they're treating me really well. Uh, and I'm super excited. You know, last time we were here, we had a war. You know, we had a lot of excitement here. And uh, I think it's, it's, it's really good to be back. You know, it's seen the fact that your son did a tremendous job fighting Terrence Crawford here in his hometown. You know, obviously back in Omaha. Have you and Crawford got to talk to each other? And no, like, you, you know, I talked to his team. You know, you know, they they uh, they're good people. You know, it was just the the week of the fight. You know, we're yeah, we're enemies. You know, uh, you know, uh, he won uh, fair and square. You know, my respects. You know, pound for pound, the best Terrence Crawford. Uh, nothing, nothing to take away from him. You know. Uh, I mean, it, it was just that, you know, uh, a show, and now, no, we're good. You know, I haven't had the opportunity to talk to him, but I talked to all his team, and everybody's cool. That's great, and then now your son's going to be in Creed 3, spoiler alert, but, you know, <laughs> doing big things. So Something like that. Yeah. And also doing big things, Cyborg's here. You got Cyborg on, the, on a, on a pay-per-view card. How exciting is that to be? Super excited, man, to be working with a legend like that, you know, uh, a monster uh uh, somebody that I was just watching on TV now I get to work with her man I never even thought about being a trainer and being here uh, and now you know look I have two world champions Jose Benavides Jr. David Benavides now Diego Pacheco and also uh, uh, Jose Valenzuela, El Rayo Valenzuela, you know, it's, it's, it's amazing uh, what uh, boxing has given me. Yeah, and then what, what's also given is amazing, another pay-per-view fight with your son, you yeah. know, Plant, David Benavides, you know. Yeah, uh, Plant, uh, we're, you know, hoping that he doesn't back out, you know, this guy is always looking for more excuses, he's looking for a way out, he already signed the contract, um, I'm just praying to God crossing my fingers that he shows up at the day of the, of the fight because David's going to kick his fucking ass, man. We're super excited, you know, for that fight. We've been trying to get that fight for almost five years, and this is more personal, you know, actually, for both, you know, and I, I'm so excited, and he has motivated us so much yeah. to train for this fight, oh, you know. I bet, I bet. It's, it's going to be a great fight, you know, yeah. nothing to take away from this guy. Caleb Plant's a good fighter. He fought Canelo. He fought good uh, fighters, you know. He has good footwork. It's going to be a little bit hard at the beginning, but we're going to kick his ass. Yeah. We're going to catch him, and uh, we're going to end up his career. You know, and the fact that uh, Jamal put some statements saying, you know, allegedly that Yeah, that other fucking in joker, it. too, you know. Um, I started uh, 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 posting shit, you know. I, I'm happy, actually, you know. Hopefully he could keep his word, you know. He says he's going to fight the winner of uh, Canelo and David Benavides. You know, that's another great fight that people want to see, you know. It's an exciting fight, another great fighter. Uh, and I hope he keeps his word, you know. And we're waiting for that. That's extra motivation for us to, to win uh, that fight against Caleb Plant, man. Uh, th those are the fights that we we've been looking for for so many years. This fucking clown's been running around and hopefully uh, 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 it can happen. And just my final last two questions, uh, a big announcement, uh, Boo Boo's fighting on a PBC card. Super excited, you know, that's the other guy that we've been fighting, you know, I'm not going to talk shit about him. He hasn't talked shit, you know, so yeah. I like him, you know, yeah. he's a very slick fighter, very awkward fighter, you know, uh, that could give anybody problems, you know, but he's in the mix and, uh, you know, uh, we, we're hoping to fight all these guys and he's one of, one of the fighters that we might be facing also. Awesome. And, um, you know, just prediction-wise, because, you know, he does have to fight Hector, you know, Garcia, but Ryan Garcia and Javante Tank Davis, do you have a prediction on that fight? Just... Man, that's another exciting fight, the fight that the fans want to see. Uh, both, of, both of them are, are really good fighters. I think uh, um, uh, Tank has fought everybody, man. He can adjust. He has more experience. But Ryan Garcia, it's a fucking animal, too. You know, hungry, tall, good left hook, you know, and... And I mean, he. Both of them train hard. Both of them are focused. Uh, it, it's an exciting fight, man. It's. An, I can't wait until that fight happens, and uh, we're definitely gonna be watching. Well, until then, we got this Saturday with you in the corner, of Cyborg. Looking forward to on Black Prime. Super Pimper excited, you. man. Super excited to be part of Cyborg team and uh man you know uh like i told her you know she has to win but she has to look impressive she can't just win a fight in order to go and and look for those big names you know for her i think it's a little bit easier because she's a champion she's a legend you know so if she does well she'll definitely be fighting somebody bigger awesome appreciate your time with you by saturday thank you thanks